Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you three easy last minute Halloween manicures. These are all super, super easy. They're really quick to do, so if you don't have any ideas for some nails that you could wear for Halloween tomorrow, then hopefully you'll find some ideas in this video. And let me know in the comments what nails you'll be wearing, if you're gonna wear any of these, or if you already have one picked out, if you're gonna dress up or anything like that. So let's get into the video. I'll be showing you these three designs and they'll be really quick and really simple. So this first design I'll be showing you is a DIY purple ombre manicure. I have been seeing these everywhere. They're super trendy right now, so I'm going to show you how to create your own at home. You will need five different shades of the same color. I chose purple because I really like wearing purple nails for Halloween, and that's literally all you'll need. Just choose some colors in the same color family. I have a really good blog post about the difference between a gradient and an ombre. You could also do this by choosing one polish and a white polish and adding some more white to it each time you apply it on your nails and I think that'll be a really creative way to do it too. So this is super simple, very trendy and a really really quick one if you don't know what to wear for Halloween and you want something that complements your costume. You could choose some colors from your costume and do something like this. I think it's really simple and very pretty. Don't forget to finish this design with a nice glossy top coat or a matte top coat if you want something a little bit different to protect it and make it nice and finished. Our next manicure will be a spooky, sparkly French mani. This might be my favorite from the whole video. So you're going to start off with a nude neutral polish, just a nice sheer color to make your natural nails look a little bit more shiny and finished. Next, you're going to take a black polish and an orange polish if you want. You could do one color, you could do both. I think it looks nice both ways. You're just going to dab this onto the tip of your nail. It doesn't have to be neat at all. You can basically just put this across your free edge or if you have really short nails, just across the edge of your nail. And I really liked using both of these colors, but you could choose different colors. All of these manicures are completely up to you if you want to match them to your costume or do some classic Halloween colors. Next, I took this really pretty orange glitter and I put it over the polishes. I tried to show you here a bunch of different examples for how you could do this. So I put the orange over the black, the orange over the orange, the silver over the black, and the silver over the orange. I think the orange over the orange might be my favorite, but you could choose a bunch of different glitters and all kinds of things to make this manicure unique. It's really quick and simple, and I think it's really pretty. And again, don't forget to finish off with top coat, maybe two coats, just so the glitter doesn't soak it all up. Our final design for today will be a simple pastel candy corn mani. I do candy corn nails every year and it's really fun. So you're going to start off with two white nails and just apply one or two coats of a white polish. I just chose some accent colors for my ring finger and my pinky because I wanted to make this mani really simple. You could do all your nails candy corn if you want but you're just going to take a pale orange color and make a stripe across the center of your nail. You don't have to worry about cleaning up, you can clean up the excess with a Q-tip or angled brush, and it's really quick and simple, so you just make the stripes across your nails. The best way to do this is to roll your hand rather than pull the brush, it creates a steadier line. And again, don't forget to finish off with top coat. These are super simple, of course you could do these on all your nails, but I figured this was a simpler option and it's really nice. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really had fun creating all these really nice manicures for Halloween. Let me know in the comments which one was your favorite and if you'll be recreating any of these for Halloween. If you do, be sure to tag me on Instagram at 360nails and use the hashtag TSNinspo to be featured. Again, all of these are super, super interpretive so you can use these manicure ideas and make them your own and add a whole bunch of different colors and designs and glitter and anything you want. It's a super creative way to do some Halloween nail art and also a big thank you to everyone on Instagram who voted for this video this week I wanted to get this one up a little bit early for you guys so you'd have it for last minute Halloween nails so I hope you all had a wonderful October I hope you have a very happy Halloween have fun and be safe and I will see you in my next video happy Halloween have a polished rest of your day bye